This is not financial advice. This is not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only. And everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos I put them out, see what I'm thinking, see how I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the data they release us is false. It's going to give us a false now to the market so we can make bad trading decisions. As of this recording, eight shares is down like 9%. It's absolutely outrageous, and the numbers don't support this price movement. The numbers don't support this price movement. And, and the, the, the thing is, the evidence of the fraud and manipulation is overwhelming, yet the SEC stays silent. The, the SEC, FINRA, DTCC, uh, CFTC, they all stay silent. The numbers show that retail investors own over 90% of the ape shares okay and then the institutions on your 13 f's are reporting about three hundred and thirty thousand. so they only own three hundred thirty thousand official ages based on your 13 f filings but like i tell you every day the numbers they report to us are false but if they only own three hundred thirty thousand ape shares and retail own 99 over 90 percent of the ape shares explain to me how they are getting shares to trade back and forth between each other to push the price down how is that mathematically possible if they own only 330,000 AMC not AMC 330,000 ape shares it's absolutely outrageous at this point the fact that the SEC sits on the sidelines and allowed this malfeasance to go down is absolutely outrageous. And this is further evidence of why the SEC needs to be investigated and why they need to be dismantled and rebuilt. There is no legal explanation for ape share being pushed down 9%, probably down like about maybe 20% in the last two weeks when technically... Legally, based on your 13 F filings, they own only 330,000 ape shares, and retail investors own over 90% of the ape shares. Where are they getting these shares from to trade back and forth between each other in a dog pool? They can't use the derivative to manipulate the price like they do with AMC and GME because there's no, there's no call options, there's no put options. But they just create these counterfeit shares, trade them back and forth between each other, and push the price down. Explain something to me. The rule of supply and demand is when there's a demand, when people are buying, when there's more buyers than sellers, the price is supposed to go up. But you have AMC apes, AMC retail investors, buying up these ape shares every single day. The buy is three, four times a sell. Yet every day the price keeps going down. This is just criminal activity, the crime of the century in real time, and the SEC does nothing. Anyway, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm. Tell me what you think about a price going down when we own over 90% of the float and they technically only own 330,000 egg shares. Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.